Do you keep a close eye on your competitors? In a competitive e-commerce space, it is difficult for companies to get the attention of customers who are exposed to several forms of digital advertising. In order to flourish on Amazon as a brand and with the digital shelf, you need to have an understanding of how well your brand is performing as compared to other brands in terms of essential aspects such as pricing, ratings, customer interaction, discoverability and content. This is when Share of Voice comes into play. Hello everyone, I'm Ankita Patil, Product Evangelist at Sanrab and I'll be discussing an intriguing topic today. How Amazon Share of Voice will boost your brand's visibility and why you should measure your Share of Voice. Share of Voice is a term that every marketer should be familiar with. But what exactly does Share of Voice mean? Let's get to it. When you go to Amazon and search for any product, say for example mobile phones, search results will be displayed on the screen. Study the order in which products appear in the search results. Pay close attention to the listings that appear first. These are the products that have the greatest visibility to consumers and generate the most clicks. In fact, studies show that products on the first page get at least 80% of all clicks. Well, it's clearly visible that Samsung and Google have a greater share of voice as compared to other competitors since they are ranking higher on Amazon serves. Amazon share of voice measures the visibility of various brands and their items on Amazon for a given set of search terms over a certain period of time and in a specific marketplace. Amazon share of voice can help you distinguish your brand from the competition and take steps to increase and maintain your share of page one Amazon search results. Now, why is it important to know your share of voice on Amazon? Integrating SOV into your list of e-commerce KPIs is one of the best methods to stay ahead on Amazon. It is crucial to highlight that SOV is more than just a measure of brand health. It is also important for competitive research and analysis. More specifically, tracking SOV allows you to answer questions like what keywords do my competitors use? What is the share of voice for both paid advertising and organic listings on the first page of Amazon SERPs? What kind of Amazon ads do my competitors run? Why should I invest as a brand? What type of Amazon ads are the most beneficial for my business? It will also allow you to understand market trends and better gauge your market share in an industry or category among prospective and existing customers. Well, here are a few points to keep in mind while conducting an SOV analysis. First, set a smart SOV objective. Before analyzing your SOV, you must determine where you are against your competitors. Set a smart that is specific, measurable, achievable, realistic and time-bound objective that is comparable to your competition once you have determined this. Once you have identified this objective, express the team's clear expectations. Ensure that you retain awareness across all domains, sales and marketing and operations, so that moving forward, there are no surprises or disputes. Second, track SOV trends. Your SOV provides insightful brand and competitor knowledge. By examining it periodically, you can determine what is working for the brand and where to devote time and resources to keep things afloat. Furthermore, bi-weekly or monthly SOV check-ins will assess track wins or losses if things aren't going well. Remember that a business's ability to stay ahead of competition by discovering possibilities before it's too late is crucial to its success. Third, make decisions based on SOV data and SOV analytics are helpful for determining the strategic direction for your Amazon business. As previously said, this information can reveal your competitor's keyword approach. Through SOV analysis, voids in your decision-making can be filled. This will enable you to optimize your campaigns with informed decisions. Now let's move on to top KPIs for Amazon share of voice analysis. First, products. It says the number of products that appeared on page one at least once for the evaluated search term during the investigated time period. Second is visibility by brand. It says the number of times a brand appeared on page one for the analyzed search terms throughout the time period study. This metric's maximum value is products into number of analyzed keywords into time period in days. For example, a company with three products that rank on page one for two evaluated keywords every day for eight days would have a visibility of three into two into eight that is equal to 48. Next is visibility by product. The average number of times a brand's product appeared on page one 
for analyzed search terms throughout the exam and time period. This metric's maximum value is the number of analyzed keywords into time period in days. It is also calculated as brand visibility divided by products and is a key performance indicator that highlights search performance efficiency by the product. Next is share of voice by brand. A brand share of voice uh, is the competitive landscape in terms of visibility on page one for the evaluated search terms for the time period study. It is calculated as brand share of voice is equal to brand visibility divided by sum of all brands visibility. Now next is share of voice by product. It is a percentage of brands average visible product in the competitive landscape in terms of visibility on page one for the examined search terms for the period analyzed. It's calculated as product share of voice is equal to product visibility divided by sum that is all products visibility. Next is estimated analyzed sales. Based on the studied time period, a speculative estimate of the analyzed sales of the brand's products appeared on page one at least once for the analyzed search terms. To improve accuracy, you can track the products of the competitive landscape over a long period of time. So how do you go about measuring your share of voice? Now, every seller will calculate the share of voice differently depending upon the metrics. In fact, you can choose to track multiple data points under the share of voice umbrella, such as organic keywords, pay-per-click keywords, reach, revenue, impressions. Simply put, the calculation for your share of voice will look something like this. Your overall projected traffic is divided by the total estimated traffic for brands in your industry and multiplied by 100. In other words, your share of voice is organic search traffic divided by the total marketing organic traffic multiplied by 100. Suppose you wish to monitor your share of voice for the keyword pink hat for women. Say your monthly impression share for that keyword is 25,000 and 1 lakh is the average monthly share volume for this keyword. So 25,000 divided by 1 lakh into 100 will give you 25%. Your listing would account for 25% share of voice for that particular keyword. You can easily measure your share of voice with Cellwrap's Chrome extension. It is a handy tool that analyzes products and keywords on the Amazon page itself to give you powerful insights and compare products on the go. Let me show you how that works. Take the example of appliances. Now go to its bestsellers page and open Cellwrap's Chrome extension. Click on product analyzer. You will immediately be presented with essential insights into all the products into your serve, such as a category, bestseller rank, buy box, price, opportunity score, listing quality analysis, estimated daily and monthly sales, estimated daily and monthly revenue, ratings, reviews, etc. You will also get the average price orders, ratings, reviews, and most importantly, market opportunity score, which shows you how profitable the niche is. The opportunity score is a unique seller app feature that analyzes a product according to six crucial metrics, demand, competition, overhead costs, PI's index, that is product innovation scope index, profit margins, and revenue potential. You can download the report where you can get a better understanding of share of voice of your brand against your competitors. Now, let's look into how to conduct share of voice analysis on Amazon. Amazon has transformed several business areas and competitive research is no exception. When performing a share of voice analysis on Amazon, it all comes down to knowing the organic and paid visibility of your competitors to the most significant keywords of your product. With Share of Voice Insights, marketers can find their share of voice for both paid advertising and organic listings on the first page of Amazon search results. You can also determine which brands appear on the first page of particular keywords. Further, you can evaluate brand positioning over time to identify trends. Share of Voice on Amazon contains three layers depending on the level of analysis desired, brand, product, and keyword. It's crucial to perform an SOB study on a brand level to look at the competitors who are using advertising to target your branded keywords. This level of analysis is essential for generating a broader view of the competitive landscape. At a more detailed level, the SOB analysis moves to the keyword or product level. The difference between these three approaches is the initial search. Now let's get to the exciting part that is strategies to enhance Amazon share of voice. First, Utilize keywords and ad types to increase brand visibility. Even though a bigger share of voice on Amazon may not immediately lead to increased sales, it demonstrates your brand's popularity and authority 
among your present and potential customers. Keyword relevancy will impact your brand's visibility and improve the conversion rates. This is why establishing a solid keyword strategy is the first and most critical step in your advertising efforts. Simply put, your business won't be able to rank for relevant keywords if you don't include them and support them with tailored advertising strategies. And the combination of sponsored and organic initiatives increase your share of voice. Consider the following keyword and ad type strategies. First, identify and target top keywords to refine existing ad campaigns. Track your campaign keywords to determine your share of voice relative to your main competitors. Project your branded keywords to guard your share of voice. Use both short and long tail keywords for non-branded phrases, the latter of which is likely to be more specific to your brand. Place your non-branded keywords in the sponsored product and sponsored brand campaigns. Use sponsored product advertising that target your top keywords to optimize your chances of landing in the top one to four placements on Amazon Soaps. Use sponsored display ads that target your competitors' ASINs. Implement day parting if you believe that your advertisements perform optimally throughout specific periods of the time. Second, check that your Amazon listing is retail ready. Ensure that your Amazon listing is retail ready, displaying useful, accurate, clear, and compelling information throughout all of your ads text and containing adequate amount of high quality photos. Leverage the A plus content offered to brand owners and sellers who are part of Amazon's brand registry in order to highlight essential product information and other items that are likely to influence purchasing behavior on your Amazon product detail page. Include your available inventory and promotions and coupons to pique customer interest in making a purchase. These elements will have a direct impact on the visible information that customers see in your ads such as customer reviews, Amazon bestseller badges, as well as your ad ranking and conversion rate. Third is tell better stories. You have surely heard how stories bring content to life, right? Indeed, it is true. Content marketing was effective because it was not advertising. It genuinely rewarded individuals for their attention. Typically, storytelling has this effect. You can tell better stories through your product images, videos, and descriptions. Fourth is work with influencers. Want more individuals to discuss your brand and content? Then seek out those who get folks talking, influencers. Partnering with the appropriate influencers can increase the credibility of your content and brand. In fact, SOV is frequently one of the most important indicators for influencer marketing programs. Fifth, invest in the promotion of content. In many respects, the ultimate metric for content promotion is share of voice. The purpose of content is for it to be read or consumed. And the purpose of content promotion is to distribute your material to your target audience. Share of voice gauges how much of an audience sees and discusses your content as well as how your content promotional campaign compares to the competitors. Six is engage with your audience actively on Amazon as well as social media. Make sure you're proactively responding to customer queries and Amazon reviews. Also, are you providing customer support via social media? If you're not, you ought to be. Social media isn't just for sharing your content, but it's also for interacting with your audience to raise your share of voice. Now let's move on to the best part, benefits of measuring share of voice. First, you can conduct a market-wide competitive analysis, determine how competitive the market is and whether you are rising star or the industry's dominant player. Second, it is utilize SOV to segment your intended audience. Calculating SOV is a potent method for analyzing your audience, but you may take additional measures to segment this data for a deeper understanding of your strengths and flaws. Consider your SOV in relation to vital regional markets, demographics, and other factors. Third, assess the effectiveness of your marketing activities. It determines whether you achieved gains in your SOV after launching a recent campaign indicating that your marketing message and methods were effective. Fourth, is improve future advertisements based on SOV report findings. Utilize the insights from your analytical reports to broaden your reach. Engage in social conversations and ensure that your voice is amplified across all of your marketing channels. In this way, by monitoring your SOV on Amazon on a regular basis, you will be able to determine your market share and how much control you have over the conversation in your niche 
among existing and potential clients. Knowing your market position puts you in a better position to discover new strategies to drive growth and acquire new clients. That's it for this video everyone. Thanks for watching. Your support means a lot to us. It encourages us to bring out more helpful videos like this. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe to Seller App. Let us know if you guys want us to create in-depth seller guides on any specific topic. You can leave your suggestions in the comment section below and we'll definitely create them for you. If you haven't already, click the bell icon so that you will never miss on any other video. And as always, happy selling!